Hello everyone, I am your VTuber Senpai, and in today's video, we will be comparing three different pieces of Live 2D software, but PRPR Live and VTube Studio. In this comparison, we are also going to look on how easy it is to import your model into each piece of software, checking out to see how well each piece of software runs on the computer, and not only that, to see different features that these applications have built in. Make sure you watch until the end of the video to see which piece of Live 2D software is the best fit for you. And if you are wondering on how to set up all these different pieces of software, I do have a playlist now appearing above to show you how to do just that. But before we do any of that, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. By liking and commenting, you actually help the video show up better in the algorithm, and by subscribing, you help us unlock different features with YouTube down the road. Also consider checking out my Twitch, my Twitter, my Instagram, and my Patreon. Links to all those in the description down below. But enough about all this, let's just jump into the comparison. All three Live 2D applications are available on the application called Steam. All three pieces of Live 2D software is free to use, but VTube Studio does have a watermark which you can remove for a small one-time fee. Let's now see how easy it is to import our avatar into these three different pieces of Live 2D software. VTube Studio is the only one of the three pieces of Live 2D software that makes you drag and drop your Live 2D folder into their own directory. While PRPR Live and VUB only require you to open the save location where you have your Live 2D saved and just click open. The advantage of PRPR Live and VUP is that you can have your applications and your Live 2D model on two separate hard drives. I prefer having my applications and my models on two separate hard drives, mainly because if I decide to wipe my windows one day, I'm not going to lose my models. They're safely stored somewhere else. Let's now run all three Live 2D applications side by side and see how much system resources they take up on the machine. We see that VTube Studio is currently using 14 to 17% of the CPU and about 500 megabytes of memory, while PRPR Live is using roughly 10% of the CPU and close to 650 megabytes of memory. VUB comes in far superior, only using 4% of the CPU and only up to 400 megabytes of memory. Please note though, mileage will vary from computer to computer. What we can see here though is VUB is the clear winner by using the less amount of resources. This can affect you if you have a potato of a computer, you definitely, definitely want to aim towards using VUB. All right, so now let's check out the advantages of each piece of software. What kind of extra goodies do they have built into them? VTube Studio has an amazing application that you can add to your phone. So if you don't have a webcam, you can actually use your phone via Wi-Fi or USB and connect it to VTube Studio, which is fantastic because not all of us VTubers out there have a large budget and we got to use what we have. So VTube Studio having an application like that is a major plus. PRPR Live has an amazing feature where you can actually collab with your fellow Live 2D VTubers within the app. All you got to do is create an account, link them all up, and you can have multiple avatars on the screen at the same time. Which is great because you don't have to worry about setting up any kind of virtual webcams or setting up things through OBS. It just works within the software and you're good to go. VUP has a built-in feature allowing you to add props live onto your model. So if you want to add chairs, drinks, pizza, whatever, you can actually add that onto the screen without needing to edit your avatar. You can also add your own props into the software. So if you want to add something else, you do have that option. And honestly, this is a really cool and neat feature to have because a lot of people want to add props but really don't know how. Leave me a comment down below of what you thought of this comparison. Which software did you find was the best and which software do you plan to use? Again, my name is Anubis Lives. I stream on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Come on by, say hi. Let's talk about anime, gaming, VTubing, whatever. And well, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.